Right guys, how's it going? And welcome to this real uh, sort of quick tutorial that I'm going to be showing you. A lot of people I've seen, including myself, were moaning this year about how it takes so long for fixtures to load when you're loading up like the uh, match facts and stuff. Especially uh, annoying for commentators like myself when you're trying to record a video and you're waiting, you know, uh, when you're mid-flow in a com in a commentary and it takes long to load. But what I've done, I've m messed around with settings and stuff, and as you can see, after I've clicked it, it just goes straight to the screen. Um, I'll show you what I've actually done. If you see, like, I've just clicked there, and then it just loads up straight away. No more waiting for match report or whatever it is. I don't want to give away my results, but um, there you go. It just loads up so quick. So I'll show you what I did. I went into preferences. Um, on my interface, I'll show you my settings because people might ask for it, but I'll untick this because... I don't know why I unticked it actually. I don't know if that'll work still for you, like if you've got badges and stuff like that. But uh, go back to overview. And the only thing that I changed was this just here interface rendering mode. Uh, it's automatically on GPU assisted, but I changed it to software. And yeah, that's all I did. That's literally it. And you'll be able to see that obviously it's really quick. Everything is like ridiculously quick um, so yeah if you go back onto your fixtures click it and pretty much straight away anyone with a better computer will just load straight up for but obviously there's a tiny bit of delay because my computer's shit but there you go it's straight onto uh, straight onto all the facts and stuff so yeah I just thought I'd show you how to do that because obviously there's a lot of people moaning and people thought people might want to know how to do it so that's how you do it if it did work for you let me know if not you can always change it back to the default but I find that works really quick for me especially in single player the the speed of the game is incredible now it's just really snappy and and quick so that's a big plus for me I'll get an episode out hopefully tomorrow with an update on how I'm doing um, but there's a bit of a spoiler here somewhere but yeah uh, you'll see how I get on and hopefully this tutorial helps you so thanks for watching guys and I'll see you soon